everyone welcome to my channel thank you so much for watching my name is Carly and I'm so happy you're here so since it's Valentine's week I wanted to do a Valentine's themed video and I decided to do the video on five ways to focus on self-care so Valentine's Day it's all about giving to others and to and about taking care of the ones you love or showing them that you love them but why not try showing yourself that you love yourself too you can you could do this the night before Valentine's Day if you're if you're married or dating or whatever. You could do this on Valentine's Day if you don't have a Valentine's Day, and that's totally fine too. So I just wanted to share with you my five things that I think would make you be able to feel a little bit more self-love for yourself this Valentine's Day. Tip number one is giving yourself an at-home facial. Why not spend a few minutes just taking care of your skin, making it so you can feel beautiful and you can feel ready to go out if you have a big Valentine's Day. Why not just feel better in your own skin? And my next tip is buying yourself something cute or sexy even if no one's gonna see it. I walked into Aerie the other day and I was pretty surprised. I actually liked quite a bit, quite a few of their bras. They have a lot of little bralettes and cute things like that and this one's just cute and lacy. And I just thought this would be fun to put under like sweatpants or under a sexy outfit if you're going out. Whatever you're going to be doing, why not have cute underwear on? Like it's the least you can do. My next tip is to buy yourself flowers. So I would recommend going to Trader Joe's since they have really great deals on flowers all the time. I think it's like a dozen for $10 or something. Like it's pretty good. So I would recommend Trader Joe's for sure. And while you're at it, why don't you pick up some chocolate because it's Valentine's and you deserve flowers and you deserve chocolate. Whether it comes from someone or you get it for yourself, you should definitely have it. My next tip is to take a journal that you love and to write 5 to 10 things that you love about yourself. And don't be worried that someone's going to see it or that it's going to sound selfish or like self-absorbed or whatever. It's not. You're allowed to love yourself, you're allowed to compliment yourself, and you're allowed to write those things down. So take a journal and just write five to ten things and just be honest and if you're like oh I shouldn't write this one it sounds kind of like selfish then you should write it because if you feel that way then you should definitely acknowledge it and be okay with the fact that you feel that way it's important to love yourself and it's important to be able to compliment yourself as well okay so my last and final tip and maybe my favorite tip is to take a nice long warm or hot bath whatever you prefer I went to Lush yesterday and I picked up this amazing bath balm. It smells so good and I'm so excited to use it. I might even cut it in half because I feel like it could do two baths. And just putting this in your bath, having lighting a candle, having some nice music that you enjoy, and just laying there and relaxing and just clearing your head and just feeling calm and not having to think about anything else. So take a nice hot bath. I think that's a really good way to show yourself love. After you're done with your bath, I'd recommend taking a shower to wash all of the bath balm off. And I would recommend using these magic crystals from Lush. That way you can get everything super exfoliated and then just shave your legs and wash your hair and wash your whole body down, wash your face, and you'll just feel so relaxed and calm. And it's one of my favorite things to do after a stressful day, so I'd definitely recommend it in your Valentine's self-love routine. I just ran my bath, it's ready to go. I'm gonna stick my bath bomb in it. I cut it in half, but it didn't go so well. It kind of is very uneven, but at least I can get two uses out of it. I lit some candles. I'm gonna use my scrub. I'm excited. So it's just gonna be a nice casual bath. I, oh, I also put Epsom salt in there. Well, that's it for this week's video. I hope you guys liked it. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and to subscribe and hit the bell if you wanna be notified. I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday and I'd love to have you here. Again, thanks for watching and let me know if you try out any of these self-love for Valentine's Day tips on your own. I'd love to hear about it and I'll see you guys next time.